The FDA adding a new warning tonight on the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. This is over a possible link to a rare autoimmune disorder. Brooke Katz with the details and what you need to know in the CBSN DFW studio tonight. Brooke? And Doug, the CDC says there have been about 100 preliminary reports of something called Guillain-Barre syndrome to the Vaccine Adverse Reporting System, or VAERS. Now keep in mind, that is out of nearly 13 million total doses given out. This is a serious condition that affects the nerves. The cases were typically reported about two weeks after vaccination, mostly in men over the age of 50. Most people who develop the condition do fully recover, but it can lead to paralysis or death in a small number of cases. Federal health officials say right now it is just not clear if the vaccine actually causes the neurological complication, but there has been an uptick in reports. I talked to Dr. Philip Wong, the Dallas County Health and Human Services Director. And I think it does show again that the system is working, there's monitoring, and that people are being very cautious about it, but it's extremely rare. So some of the symptoms to know, tingling or weakness in your arms and legs, difficulty walking, double vision. You should call your doctor if you develop any of these issues. The U.S. sees an estimated three to 6,000 cases per year, and the disorder usually develops after respiratory or gastrointestinal infections. So Dr. Wong says it can happen after COVID infections. It has also been seen after other vaccines like the ones for flu and shingles.